a new power, a new understanding of power is a part of the new consciousness. And that new understanding of power is alignment of your personality with your soul. So what does that mean? The intentions of your soul are harmony and cooperation and sharing and reverence for life. And as you align your personality with your soul, you create an authentically powerful life. And that is now our evolutionary modality. That is how we now evolve as multisensory humans. So this is where we are. We're in a time of ending and a time of beginning. And we're all involved in that. And this has never happened before in the human species. The transition from five sensory to multi-sensory has never happened before. It also is unprecedented. So we are in unprecedented times, having unprecedented experiences that humans in the past have not had, have not had. So the question is, what shall we do? We are waking up to uh, thirsting for harmony and cooperation and sharing and reverence for life. And we're waking up in a world of discord and competition and hoarding and exploitation of life, a world in which life is a cheap commodity. All of us who are multi-sensory are waking up to this and all of us in the human species in the next few generations will wake up to it and be asking ourselves these questions. So this is what I've come on to your summit to discuss with you because it is affecting everything that we experience, everything that we do. Creating authentic power is acting from loving parts of your personality while frightened parts of your personality are active in you. In other words, while you're feeling the pain of judgment, the pain of disdain, the pain of anger, the pain of jealousy, oh, that's terrible, the pain of vengefulness. While you're feeling that, and that's what emotional awareness, as you develop it, allows you to feel. You can, in that moment, reach for the healthiest part of your personality that you can. Well, what are they? And what do they feel like? The healthiest parts of your personality originate in love. They're the parts of your personality that you experience as gratitude or appreciation or caring or patience, or contentment, or awe of the universe. And when you act on them, you create wonderful consequences that, consequences that feel wonderful, and they are healthy and constructive. And that's what you contribute to the world. You contribute to the world and you learn wisdom through love and trust, instead of through fear and doubt, which is how you learn it. When frightened parts of your personality are active, you don't know it, or you're multisensory and you do know it and you don't challenge them. This is the creation of authentic power and this is our new evolutionary modality. <laughs>